Hello everyone, I'm just making this video to show you how to create uh, an interactive chart for your GDP page. Um, I think we went over another technique a while ago. I just want to show you another one to use a, a, a form control. Now the first thing you need to do in order to make this happen is you need to make sure that you have the developer tab available on your um, toolbar. And the way you do that is you right click anywhere on uh, on your toolbar and you put customize ribbon then right here you'll see the developer and it's going to be unchecked check it and then when you click OK you'll see the developer toolbar and in particular we need it because we need to insert a checkbox and I'll show you that in a second so first thing I did is I inserted a blank sheet sheet one right and what I did is I copied my GDP data, the growth rates, right here, and I copied it right here. Now I'm, I'm ready to put my potential GDP growth rate. Now if you go back to the GDP page, you see my potential growth rate is 1.5% for Canada, right? And so what I'm going to do is this. I'm going to put 1.5% right here. So I'm going to type in... 0 0.015 that's one and then I'm going to autofill that across and notice how I didn't put it here because I want to use a an if statement uh, to put the if uh, the potential GDP here and what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, key it on this value here I'm going to type in true and I'm going to say this he goes he goes if this cell right here equals true, then put in this value. Otherwise, give me an NA error. Close parentheses. Um, now, I have to uh, make sure that this is absolute cell reference, so I'm going to put dollar signs there, hit enter. And then I can autofill this across. See? Now we're ready to create our graph. So I'm going to highlight the data here, including the potential GDP. I'm going to click on Insert, Line Graph. And then I'm going to move this into my GDP page. I'm going to click move, right click and put Move Chart. And I'm going to go to uh, GDP, click OK. There, I'm going to move this down here. Now what I'm going to do is I'm now going to create a checkbox. I'm going to go to the Developer tab. I'm going to go to Insert, and this is the checkbox right here. I'm going to draw it right here. And then I'm going to change this text to potential, I like that, potential, and then I'm going to right click on it again and click on form, form control. And then I'm going to click on this box here and then I'm going to go back to sheet one and I'm going to link it to this right here. Click enter, hit enter and click OK. And now watch. I'm going to click outside of it. And watch when I click on it. Check on it. I got it. It's there. Check on it again. It goes away. See? That's a nice way of making uh, your um, bot, uh, graphics interactive. Okay? That's all for now.